I love black because it affirms styles and designs. A woman in a black dress is a pencil stroke. Eve's Saint Laurent. Thank you for tuning in to Brand Plus TV. It is always a pleasure having your company. My name is Kelly Wills and welcome to Fashion Hub Extra. This is a segment where we go all out on matters fashion and bring you all the fashion news making headlines around the globe. So far, so good. It has, it has been and still is a year full of fashion statements left, right and center. As we welcome the month of November, happy new month, y'all. Halloween has been the subject of our lives. October just ended and it ended with all the creepy, spooky fashion style you could imagine. Being the Halloween month, Halloween lovers from across the world do not hold back in dressing their best and most over-the-top costumes. This year, the style set did not hold back from glitter, sequins, sparkle, feathers, furs. Basically, nothing was left out. Of course, we didn't miss out on what our favorites did this year. We had the Queen Beyonce's Halloween costume breaking the internet. The star, who is 37 and a mother of three, channeled Tony Braxton circa 1993 for her Halloween costume this year, which she shared with her fans on Instagram. And to no one's surprise, the beehive was having a freakout. Mrs. Carter recreated Braxton's self-titled album cover, Tony Braxton, by wearing a short pixie wig, a fitted white tank, light wash, high-waisted jeans, a leather jacket and chain belt which was identical to the R&B singer's look. The only change instead the only change instead of reading Tony Braxton on the album cover, Beyoncé quickly changed the lettering to Phony Braxton on her recreations of all three of Braxton's iconic cover shots. Heidi Klum loves Halloween. No one goes harder than a Heidi. No one sits in glam or a special effects pro prosthetic chair longer than Heidi. No one is more uncomfortable at the party than Heidi Klum. It's worth it though, because you can count on her going beyond during this holiday as much as you can. This year was no exception. Heidi and her boyfriend Tom were Fiona and Shrek. She even had little ogre ears poking out of her red wig, making the ensemble as realistic, realistic sorry, as possible. Tom also had his lock down to a T, complete with a special effects makeup and Shrek's signature tunic and vest. And because a good cosmetic uh, costume can only get better with props, Klum also brought along a wooden stroller with a couple of green ogre babies. This is amazing, right? Now, when Black Panther hit the theaters a while back, it was guaranteed there would be a lot of Halloween costume inspirations. Lucky for us, Sierra came through with one of the best Black Panther inspired get-ups when she dressed as a philanthropic but kicking heroine Nakia. She donned a gleaming black, red, and gold structured suit and bodies with a pair of thigh high boots. To top it all off, she rocked a hairstyle similar to Nakia's. Her husband, Rizel Wilson, dressed as Black Panther himself, and her two children, Sienna and Future, were mini versions of Nakia and Black Panther. We had our very own Lupita Nyongo channeling Dion from Clueless had us totally gagging and bugging. Lupita never ceases to amaze us when it comes to looking gorgeous both on and off the red carpet. Lupita had every detail of Dion's look down to a T. From the hat to the knee-high socks and black heels, her black, white, and red ensemble is the clueless costume we needed in our lives. She even rocked green contact lenses and small black bag with giant intercuated glittery cell phone because she's that dedicated to her craft. Can anyone top this? As if. Halloween is not only for the older ones. Nah, it's for everyone, even kids. You can dress them up and they will be the cutest beings on earth. 
On Wednesday, Kim teased on Twitter, wait until you see Saint and Rain's Halloween costumes. A few hours later, the wait was over and boy, was it worth it. Kim and Kanye's two-year-old son, St. West, and Courtney's three-year-old son, Rain Disick, gave a huge shout-out literally to Kanye's song, I Love It, with Lil Pimp. The costumes are exact replicas of the gigantic square-shouldered shirts, pants, and shoes, and because Rain and Saint are small to begin with, the looks fit them perfectly. They are, of course, wearing Yeezy slides and sneakers. Rain and Saint imitated the music video to a tea. Also, their cousin True Thompson wasn't left behind. True and her mom, Chloe Kardashian, wore quite a number of matching costumes. This is so adorable. Close at home. Never mind the fact that this is not yet as big as festivity on this side of the globe as it is in the West. The tradition is spreading widely and has recently cast a net in Kenya. Check these looks out and share with us what your costume was like using the hashtag Fashion Hub Extra. That is all for now, but be sure to catch us next weekend as we serve you some more extraness in matters fashion. Get through to us with the number on your screen and our social media platforms, Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. The handle is Brand Plus TV. We would like to hear your thoughts on Fashion Hub Extra. Until next time, remember, fashion fades, style, and doors. Keep watching.